Hey guys, this is Mark here from PFT and today I have a slightly different video for you. I'm actually going to be reviewing a selfie stick. You told me a couple of weeks ago that I was going to be making a video reviewing a selfie stick. I simply would not have believed you. Selfie sticks are really simple, basic products that um, personally I wouldn't have looked at before. It's not really the kind of thing I'm into um, and it's really basic technology that, as I said, simply didn't interest me. But when I got sent this to review, after looking at it a bit, I realised there are quite a few fairly impressive features in this that I thought you guys would be interested in. So I decided to make this a kind of short review slash overview video of it to kind of let you guys know about this video. Now, of course, if you're interested in buying it, the links will be down in the description for you, and there will also be links to a full article over on our website, so feel free to check that out. Now, taking this out of the box, we have multiple parts to put this together. So you have the remote trigger, which works through Bluetooth in a similar way to a Bluetooth headphone. So um, on most devices, you can actually take pictures using the volume buttons, and that is basically how this works. It is a volume trigger that um, will, of course, work with the camera app. Now, this is compatible with both iOS and Android, so you don't really have to worry about compatibilities, and it has a small clip to attach it to the monopod, which is very impressive. Now, of course, we have a monopod, which is going to be your main kind of piece um, in this product. It is telescopic, which is extremely handy, as you can change the length of it to get slightly different angles. It has a wrist strap at the bottom, which I suppose would be handy um, for attaching it to things or ensuring that you don't drop it. Now, on the top of this monopod, we have a regular tripod mount, which you could attach to any point-and-shoot camera. Um, things like GoPro, if you have the needed accessories, um, or even a DSLR, if you are brave enough. Of course, this is meant for smartphones and even tablets, so it comes with an adjustable um, holder on the top that should work with all devices. On the bottom of the monopod there is also a tripod mount which I will kind of speak about a bit more in a while because that is a um, feature that I was really interested in. Um, but for now I'm just going to kind of speak about the performance of this. So it has a really nice reach, you can get some extremely good angles with this. And I suppose if you're into taking selfies or portrait videos this is going to be brilliant but I kind of prefer using this more for video, um, so for example if you were skiing or snowboarding this would get you some brilliant shots especially with the addition of a GoPro and even for vlogging and things like that if you're walking about this is going to get you a much nicer wide angle, get more of the background in there and it's going to give you a much better kind of viewing experience. Now a problem I've seen with a lot of selfie sticks is the angle of the top part. So. If the angle is kind of too close in comparison to the pole, then you will see the pole in the bottom of the shot, which really doesn't look very good. Now, the way that this is designed, um, it kind of curves in a... I don't really know how to describe it, but basically, you're not going to see the pole in the bottom of the photo, so it almost looks like someone else is taking a photo of you from afar. Um, so this is obviously going to improve the quality of your photos, and... Um, it's just a really nice, impressive feature, and it's nice that they thought that out. Now, as I said, there is a threaded tripod mount on the bottom. Now, this can be used for a couple of things. So, for example, you could actually attach this to a tripod to get some extra height. So, if you had something like a table tripod, desk tripod, or even just kind of a mini phone tripod, you could attach this to the bottom um, of the selfie stick or the monopod and attach your camera to the top, and it would get you a nice higher angle. Now, something that isn't really recommended, but I did try, was that you can actually daisy chain these. So I had two monopods, and I attached the tripod thread on the top of one to the bottom of the other, which gave me double the reach, which I would say gave me around six foot worth of selfie stick. And here you can see a photo that I took with it. Now, this is of course not recommended. It was just a kind of weird experiment I did to see if it would work. And it did, which I suppose is kind of cool, though I wouldn't really see you using this. Now, of course, as I said, this is a very simple product, and there isn't much more for me to go over. As I said, um, for what it is, this is definitely very good. It is extremely adjustable, works with a huge range of devices, and I really like it for use with things like the GoPro to get those nice wide-angle shots. 
That has been it for this video. If you like this video, please give it a like, share, and why not subscribe to my channel? If you've got any questions, please just leave them in the comment section below or email me at the address in the description. Thank you very much for watching. See ya.